Hello everybody, it is Jesse Pinwheel, and welcome to another episode of Jesse Plays Minecraft. So, yeah. I've been, I'm, well, I, not I have been. I am currently getting some more coal because I need to cook up some clay into bricks. And I don't know how to get back up. Um, how do I get back up there? Alright, just make a staircase. Good enough for me. Hop on up. So, I've gotten a little bit of stuff done since last time. Not a lot. The main thing that I've gotten finished so far is I've cleared out the land and I have gotten some more clay. So that is always good. Always good to have clay. Especially if you want to be making lots and lots and lots of bricks. I don't have nearly enough bricks. I. This is just going to be... This is going to be interesting. There's not going to be any clay left in this world when I'm done with all the clay getting that I need to do. It's going to be ridiculous. I need more coal. Okay, well, I'll just drop my clay off here for now. And let's just head on out. So, I finished this right here. Finished up my little enchanting area. The uh, the enchanting table is right above the right above the spawner. In case you didn't get that, um, I've been enchanting a lot of helmets because I've been trying to get Aqua Affinity, which I did finally get. I'm probably going to keep enchanting helmets because I really want to get one with both with both aqua affinity and that other thing, respiration. So today we're going to start hollowing out. We're going to start digging up some land for making it ready for our wonderful, wonderful house building thing. So yes, I am basing this building. I'm not running in the right direction, am I? I'm running in the opposite direction of where I want to be going. So I'm... I am basing this building that I'm making on one that does actually exist. But it's not one that anyone's really going to recognize because it's not a famous building. It's just one that I saw and I like freaking ravine. This might not be the best place to be building a house because there's a ravine going through here. But oh well, just deal with it. Cover it up. It'll be fine. Oh, and it's it's getting dark. Oh, I don't have string, do I? Hmm. So yeah, I've got rid of all the trees here. I flattened the area out. Wonderful. Okay, time to start digging. So I need to flatten this out even more. That's basically what I need to do. So, I'll be back. So my shovel's broke. So I came here to grab a few more. Since I've got some. This is my, uh, this is my way of changing how much Changing how much stuff I want in my enchanting table. So let's see. I need a level 1 enchant. Unbreaking 1, that's not that great. Level 1. Efficiency 2. Wow. I do like that. Because it's really fast and it's really easy to just fix it, put it away. Yeah. Back to the peninsula, so we can start digging out some space. I've run out of- I'm running out of coal, that's- that's worrying me. But, you know, there's always charcoal and, you know, there's plenty of trees around. So I'm not especially worried about that. So, let's get started. 
Time to dig. Question is, what level do I want it to be on? I need it to be all flat, don't I? Hmm. I kind of do need it to be all flat. Yeah, well, I guess I'll be back again later. Be right back. Well, it's flat. Need to eat some more zombie meat. It's kind of a pain. Okay. Well, I flattened out this area. It is now ready to be turned into a building. Which is what we want. Later I'm probably going to have to flatten out the other side, but let's not worry about that right now. So let's get some torches, start marking things. I'll just mark it with cobble, actually. So let's see... Where do I want the courtyard to be? I think that I would want the courtyard on that side, actually. So it'd be more that way. So that way when you're in the actual building, you'll have this view of the ocean. Which I think would be nice. Let's see. Okay. So, let's see. Oh, uh, but I need to base it on the courtyard then. So let's see, I need... Let's say that I start around here. Just for, like, in this direction, not this direction. So if I start from here, I'm going to want stairs that go down for about five blocks. And then there's this break, and then there's another like three blocks here. So this is the middle of the stairs right there. And then there's a wide staircase that goes down a few blocks, so it's very it's pretty wide, so it's like that. And then Actually, I think that it might be a bit wider than that. If you're wondering why I haven't enchanted this diamond pick, it's because it's almost dead anyways. It's not really worth it. It looks like this. So there's gonna be a staircase that goes for this length, and then a middle area, and then another area over here that comes around, and there's more steps, so it would come out to here. So then, you can see this courtyard's gonna be pretty big courtyard area. Hmm. I think that's how it's gonna work, so it's gonna be about that wide. Uh, this is gonna be a bit hard to do, because I don't really know how... because I can't remember exactly how large the building is, and I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to see the building before I keep working on this, so... Those are just my guidelines for now. I guess for now, we'll just go... Dig up some clay for a little while. Because <laughs> there's really not a lot I can do, because I need to build the courtyard first, and... I don't remember exactly how it looks. I know there's a fountain in the middle, there's some trees, there's a lot of... There's a lot of plants, shrubberies... A shrubbery. <laughs> Monty Python. I don't actually watch Monty Python. So, I'm gonna go get some shovels. Sorry that we are not actually doing building. <laughs> you thought we were going to do building, but you are wrong. We're actually going to be digging clay. Uh, this is gonna be such an exciting episode. Okay, well, head on over to the zombie farm up there there. It's one thing I really like about the glass tower. It's very, very easy to see because it's very bright. It's very white-ish. Because I personally don't really like the glass texture in Minecraft. It's too not see-through. I mean, yeah, you can see through it, but it's a little noisy for my tastes. So let's see. Um... I'll turn this on. Where's my... Where's my Aqua Affinity helmet? I think I left it downstairs, actually. I should really install a water drop or something. Yeah, 
here it is, Aqua Affinity. My Aqua Affinity Helm. And I need some shovels. And then we can go out and get some clay. Well, I'm gonna need some dirt, too. Okay. So I will get everything together, and then I will be right back again. Okay, so... Clay. Is what is happening right now. So I'm filling this stuff in so the currents are all aren't all weird and things like that. Oh, I'm drowning again. This is why I want a respiration and aqua affinity helmet, not just an aqua affinity helmet. Be so much better. Have respiration so I don't have to deal with all this all the time. Huh. <laughs> Getting air? What do you think I am? Some kind of human being? Yeah, that sort of stuff. No, give me that clay. I want the clay. I need the clay. Need all of the clay. So I'm displacing it with sand. Because sand's pretty easy to get and everything. So why do I need so many bricks? It's because the building that I want to make is made completely out of bricks and glass. So no, it probably was not the best choice of building, but oh well. I mean, originally I thought it was going to be like steel or so, like black, like dark steel or dark metal of some sort. So I thought I was gonna have to get a lot of obsidian. Oh wait, what the? Okay, that was all right. Um, so I was thinking that I was gonna have to get a lot of obsidian, but no, that's not the case. It's just lots and lots of bricks. Which is really almost just as bad because there's a- I mean, it's easy to find obsidian. Just go to- go underground, go to that level, you get it everywhere. Oh, whoa, what the? That's a village! That's a village! Whoa! Okay, hold up, hold up, what's going on here? I wanna see this. Oh man, this is the, uh, I think this is one of the first legit villages I've ever seen. <laughs> wow, this is, this is unexpected. Okay, well, it's gonna think, I was thinking that this, vi that this episode might be a bit short, but no, apparently not. This might, this might go all the way to the 15 minute mark. No, get, get out of the way. I need to get up. Testificates. People. I guess I'll have to go see if there's a smithy so I can loot their stuff. I'm not a very courteous neighbor. Is that... what is that? A... Is this like a library? Has to be, right? Let's see, look around. What would this be, like a shop? It's getting all dark. See, there's their well. There is a blacksmith. Fantastic. Okay, let's see, what do they have? Two apples, two iron swords. Uh, it's not that good. Do have lava, though. It's a lighting glitch here. There we go, lighting glitch fixed. Okay, well, that was an interesting find for today. But I think that this episode will be pretty short. Um, I'm going to be ending it off pretty soon, because I don't really have anything to talk about. Or anything really to do besides get clay, and we all know that just getting clay isn't that interesting. So next time we meet, though, next episode, I will be doing... I'll be working on the... I'm going to start working on the actual house building thing so because that by because then I'm going to probably be a lot more I'm gonna what's the word I'm looking for I'm gonna be more prepared I'm gonna be I'm gonna know what the building actually looks like I'm getting shot at again I can yeah there's chickens here don't really need chickens uh, what other food do I have 
always have mushrooms, I just never eat them for some arbitrary reason. But yeah, so... Thanks a lot for watching. See you next time. And I'll be digging clay.